All right, welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. So, uh, not a lot to report on. Uh, we did find the hatch over here, so let's go ahead and feed him something. Uh, igneous rock, sedimentary rock. Actually, we don't have anything in here. Huh. Well, hmm. We need to sweep up something to feed them, because I don't want to feed them this other stuff. Huh. All right, let's sweep that then. Might as well sweep that. Oh man, this is a death chamber here. <laughs> chamber of death. Oh, poor Niles. That's what happened to him. All right, speed it up, guys. Let's go. All right. Okay, and this is also becoming a death chamber. Oh my god, don't get trapped in there. Oh no, we're, you're going to be fine. we got a manual airlock here. What am I talking about? Okay. Let's dig out this ore. And that is the way we're going to do it. Alright, do we have enough cots for everybody? we got four there. we got nine there. And so... That's four, nine, plus six is fifteen. We got just enough cots. Just enough. But I'm going to, with furniture, put in another cot. Whoops. Cot does not belong in the air. Cot belongs here. Okay. Briar seed. And we're making mush. Whoops, there we go. It's grizzly. Mush is grizzly food. Oh, bristlewood blossom. It's actually growing. Interesting. Very slowly, but it is growing, apparently. So is the mealwood. Hmm, interesting. Carbon dioxide. We have liquid carbon dioxide up here because it's so cold. And... Oh, we harvested them! Okay, so we want to put those seeds... Thimble reed seeds. Can we get uh, seed in here as well? Thank you. And let's get those gathered. All right. And sleet wheat is not really growing. Ah, I would love to make a farm for the sleet wheat. That's going to take a little bit of doing. But we need another farm, period. I think we might try the thimble reed first. That might be a little easier to set up. Maybe not. Who knows? We shall see. God, this one pump is doing a lot of work for our whole colony. And we're take, But we're sucking it in as much as we can. We still do not have that much carbon dioxide accumulating down here. I don't care. We're going to get it pumping in, okay? Like, until it fills up this whole room to, like, unbearable levels, then that's what we're doing. Um, okay. Do we need to turn this up a little bit more? I think we do. Just a little bit more. Keep this polluted water coming through. What I'd really like, I should have, like, kind of hooked it up over here so that this has a lot more to drip down. And if that's really how I feel then let's just do it that way. Um, is that really how I feel? Mm. I'm going to leave it alone for now. I'm not sure how I feel about it. I need to think about the plumbing a little bit more. We want more to be coming into here is basically the issue. And I could do that very simply by moving the plumbing into the wall, like so. I think I'm going to do that, actually. There we are. And once you guys get those pipes built, deconstruct these pipes. Okay. All right. Did we gather up 
our stuff. I think we did. And now the next thing we're going to do is food, food, food. Okay, everybody's fine. We just have a regular food shortage. Hydroponic farm. No, no. Aquatic farm tile. And we're going to put it down here and here. And we're going to start working on some thimble reed thingies. I think they're pretty easy to grow, actually. We'll see. Hmm. The water's actually pretty warm over here. It's cold over here. Colder. And it's getting warmed because it's coming through here. So, It's not a good system, but it's a system that's working nonetheless. Okay. And let's put in... So what do you need? Uh, for excellent, 80 plus points. Temperature, decor, plus 10. Uh, growth requirements, temperature 25 to 45. Okay. Well, not quite hot enough. Not quite hot enough. Hmm. How do we want it? So how do we want to heat that up then? Uh, we could just run the pipe through there a little bit more. Uh, we could run the pipe down along here and then back up. And did we fix our pipes over here? Kind of. <laughs> okay, so we need to put... Okay, what we need to do is we need to actually shut this off. Okay, so this is gonna this is gonna kind of suck for a bit. Disable the building, and we need to suck out all of this polluted water first. That's gonna take a while. And in fact, means we're gonna turn this all the way up and really get it moving. And once these pipes are clean then we can deconstruct this without uh, generating the polluted water. Because if I deconstruct it while there's water in it, then you're going to drop polluted water onto the ground, and that's no fun. Over here... Uh, polluted ice, you say? Yeah, I don't want to deal with the polluted ice. Yeah, I think we're fine. Something happened here. Alright, I say... I wouldn't mind getting that other Wheeze Ward if I could get to it, but it's a little far away. Especially since we don't have a warm sweater for anybody. Uh, food is low. So let's make more of that. Okay. We're running through it. We're running through it. Okay. Yeah, see, it's an all... It's a really wonky system we have here. Actually... Actually, hang on a sec. Did I just inadvertently... No, I didn't. <laughs> We're just gonna fix it this way, though. Okay. Oh, you know what I could have done? I could have disabled these buildings, too. That might have been faster, but... Yeah. Hindsight. Hind sight, I say. And where are you guys going to go? I think, actually, we could probably take the risk. Liquid pipe. Deconstruct. Maybe we'll make it in time. We did. Oh, but now it's stuck here. That was a mistake. Okay. Liquid pipe. Back you go. Priority. Oh, is she working on it? Nope. Alright, liquid pipe. Priority 9. And you know what? Because I haven't done it yet this whole game. Red alert! Do it! Work now! Uh, I say. I say. There we go. Okay, now go back to bed. Okay. 
Oh, did we get a excellent yield? Awesome. That is good news. Oh, and hey, we can actually... Now that would have been a good time to deconstruct the pipe. Uh, let's give it a shot. Ah, no, let him, let him use the bathroom real quick. Oh, that's the slowest, most inefficient way. What I should have done, like I said before, is just disabled all of these and then let it run. But it's okay. If you're playing on your own, it's fine. It's like, it, it, yeah, but if I'm actually trying to show something on camera, I would kind of rather... Actually, why don't I do it that way right now? Uh, disable. 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 Okay. And now, let's deconstruct liquid pipes. Let's take a look at our pipe overlay here. There we go. And that should... Okay, that sets that up that way. Alright. Uh, yeah, you guy's gonna deconstruct that, I'm sure. Now, how else do I want to run this pipe? So we could run it up and over and then down like that. I think I'm gonna do it. And that's gonna give that an interesting an interesting layout. But it means we're gonna have all this backing up for um, our plants. I think. I hope this is gonna be fine. All right, and we can turn these on now. Is there a... No, I don't see it. Dang it, we have to do it all one by one. There we go. And we need to enable this. And it's priority. Where, why can't I see it's priority? Uh, maybe I can assign it a priority. Well, that's why you have a switch. Um, I haven't been using any electric switches. I do use them once in a while. But, uh, like, it would be good to have just a switch to activate this thing and put the switch, like, right here. In fact, why don't we just... Well, because it'll be underwater. <laughs> we are running through our water pretty rapidly, though. Chilly surroundings. Stifled because of chilly surroundings. Yeah, I know. Uh, that's why I want to deal with this over here, maybe. Like, yeah, I'd kind of like to run. Uh, I could run the pipe all the way down through here before I run it back up. And then out. That's what we'll do. Oh boy, this is some silliness. All right, pipe. I want you to be insulated for some of the ride though. So from here, insulated with igneous rock, I wanna say. Overheat temperature, granite. Nah, I think, an, I think Nah, insulated, uh, okay. Well, to get this to work, first of all, we're going to need to deconstruct our pipe. Okay. Uh, plumbing overview. Okay, so we're going to have uninsulated pipe run through here, and then insulated pipe run around over here. And then de-insulate it down here. And we're going to make this pipe in here. Actually, let's just deconstruct all of it. All right, we're going to make it out of, uh, not sandstone, but uh, instead igneous rock, because it's a little bit harder to overheat. 
So, number five. Ins no, not insulated. Liquid pipe out of igneous rock. Okay. And we want to run it. around our coal generator. And then we want to insulate it. No, we can keep it uninsulated this far. And then start insulating it at this point. And then de-insulate it. And here we can just use sandstone. And then, I don't care how much heat it loses as it comes up to here. Okay, what a weird, wacky, wild, weird stuff. Okay, let's see how that works. So that'll cool off our coal generator just a little bit. It'll pick up this warmth, I hope. Man, I really hope that works. We'll see. Uh, food shortage, building lacks resources. Uh... Let's make more food, please. Oh, man. We're getting the lice coming in, though. Okay, over here. Let's, uh... We got the pickled meal on continuous, so hopefully they'll make that. <sighs> All right. Battery, battery, battery. Yeah, we're getting good harvests over here. That's nice. Alright guys, let's uh, let's prioritize this situation over here. Yeah? This will put back down to six. Alright. And then eventually we'll probably want to run the pipes through here where it's like ultra super awesome hot. Okay. 23. I really hope that works. I hope that's going to be enough heat. I hope that this these pipes are going to accumulate enough heat on the way. Uh, how can I take a look at my temperature? So, it's 31. How can I see if my... Uh, well, I would love to be able to see what the temperature in my pipes is. Body heat retention, body heat loss... No. Gas pipe, liquid pipe components, which we can't take a look at yet. Tile. 27 degrees. Okay. Yeah, we'll just have to take a look at the pipes individually to see if they're getting through there. Okay, and in the meantime, while well, I, I get laser focused like that, and then I neglect other things that need to be done. Um slime well hmm gold amalgam would be nice oh yeah that's right don't we have a big big chunk of it up here we do we do indeed let's see if we could get all the way over there let's take this out Root, granite, igneous rock. Oh boy. Okay, let's watch and see how you guys do. You're not going to like it up here, I guarantee it. <laughs> yeah, you really don't like it. And just in time for it to be nighttime. Okay, do we have anything in here that we can uh, dump out for these guys to eat? We still don't, do we? Maybe we won't put that on sweep. We'll just let people stockpile it a little bit normal. And give those hatches some food. Normal temperature. It is warm over here, isn't it? It is. Let's speed that up and go through the nighttime. I'm thinking about insulating this, too. Alright. How's our. Unbreathable. We are still not able to pump up 
enough pressure over here. Uh, let's see. There we go. Put that tile in there. Uh, we lack igneous rock. Well, that sucks. Where can we get some igneous rock real quick? Well, not from there. Granite. Igneous rock. Ice. Obsidian. Granite. Sandstone. Igneous rock. There we go. Grab some. Let's get on that. Let's P9 it. Because until you guys get it, we aren't getting nothing done. Alright, here you come. Yeah, mine that out. Boom. Shakalaka. Oh, that's not good. I need to P9 that, too. Thank you. Hop to it, laddies. Now oh, this polluted water is nasty, too. What are you doing? Oh, okay. Oh, guys, come on. It's because of the oxygen, isn't it? Finish the task. Good. I don't care as long as you're picking up the igneous rock. And getting this done, I hope. Okay, come on. There we go. Pick it up. And you guys gonna get this done over here, please? Thank you. Oh, one more. It's P8. It is P8. Ah, oh, Tylus. Man, this is a... This is really dense carbon dioxide. This is where we need our carbon scrubber. I don't know why it's taking so dang long for this carbon dioxide to make its way out. We're sucking it in and pushing it out. How we doing? Did we did it? Did we done do it? Polluted ice. That's fine. Leave it alone. Okay, we've got it running. So, tell me. Insulated pipe. Yeah, we're not getting enough. We're not getting enough heat. Contents. Well, we're sending it down now. This is just not getting hot enough. Liquid pipe contents. Show me the pipes again. No, I don't want to look at the generator. I want to see the liquid pipe. 20... 31... Uh, 31... Show me the pipes again. Uh, then it goes down to 28 here. Maybe these need to be insulated. So here it's starting to cool off, and it's partly because there's water on the ground here too. I just bet you. Uh, okay. Fine. So what we're going to do then is, once again, so that was a little bit of an experiment. We're going to remove the pipe here and we're gonna make it insulated and hopefully we will do that with uh, again the igneous rock yeah insulated pipe there we go and we need to p9 that okay and yeah, I think the water in here is also helping to keep things cool, so we may ought to mop, mop all day long. 
mop, mop, mop while I sing this song. There we go. And that is getting us close to done. And we're going to be ready to do some exploration. Almost. Actually, we should probably get this all taken care of over here. I wanted to run my heavy wire down this hatch. Okay. Set up our generators all nice and proper. Proper horror show. Uh, you guys cannot get to that, eh? Probably because you don't have enough... Yeah, you probably can't swim there. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> How far could you get if I put my mind to it? I don't know. And again, this is never gonna fill up <laughs> is what I'm afraid of. It's just not ever filling up. Okay, getting the pipes done. Generator is idle. So actually we could let heat in through here. Nah, we should just, eventually we should just run the pipe over in here and get it hot if that's what we really want to do. Now, the other thing I was thinking about is deconstructing these walls and putting insulation in instead. I think we're going to do that. Because this does not need to get hot. And we can undo that as well. Yep. This is going to be a bit of a mess. Insulated tile out of sandstone should be fine. Oh, we have another duplicate. I have to take one right away. Okay, choose a duplicate. Early bird. Biohazard. Oh my god. Nails again. Oh, it's Nisbet. I love Nisbet. Irritable bowel this time, though. So yeah, the names and the portraits, I think, say the same, but their traits get randomized. Plus seven strength. 105 carrying weight. Bodybuilder. Iron gut. Naturally robust. Uh... Oh, yeah, no, she is. That is her. Stress response is destructive. I love Nisbet. She is so cool. Um, yeah. You have to be the one. I, I love Nisbet. I have a history with Nisbet. Okay. And jobs. Nisbet, you are just kind of bad at everything. <laughs> um, so... Compost, research, hydrofan... Build, mm, I don't know. Whatever. Okay. Anyway, how are we doing over here? Oh, good. We uh, need to one insulated tile out of sandstone. Put it in, and put in our insulated tile over here. All right. So this is going to heat this room up quite a bit, but hopefully, chilly surroundings, man. Mm. 23 degrees compared to what's going on over here. How am I going to warm up this water? It's insulated all the way down to here. And this pipe just isn't enough to warm up that water. Stress. Our stress is only at 60. We're fine. It's only 60%. Okay, more insulated tile. Here. And... That is going to be where I think we pause the game. And, yeah. Uh, I'm going to take a look around again, make some plans, and then resume the episode. In the next episode, I should say. Um... As always, thanks for watching. I am going to get this temperature thing licked. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you next time. Till then. Bye-bye.